this way. The, the Conservative Party cannot form a government unless it is uh, doing very well, and I think ideally is the party of choice amongst uh, new Canadians and members of our cultural communities. This is something I said to Stephen Harper. He, remember, he and I had a, <laughs> I'll tell you a funny story. I think in 1995, uh, Stephen was leaving as a reform MP, uh, and I was in town here visiting as the president of the Canadian Taxpayers Federation. It was 96, and we went off uh, to watch uh, Quentin Tarantino's Pulp Fiction. I thought it was pretty cool. He was totally disgusted. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so after that, we, we, we sat down and had dinner at the Mayfire Pub, a pub on, uh, on Bank Street. And I said, you know, Stephen, we're never going to be a, a governing coalition unless we're the party of New Canadians. He was skeptical he said, because he said, you know, so many uh, New Canadian communities are locked into the Liberal coalition. Yep. It seems yep. almost permanently. Yep. I just th saw, th saw an, a natural alignment between New Canadians and Conservative values. I said, we just need to in a very purposeful way, get people to vote their values. So in 2006, after we won the election, having made progress in, uh, in those communities, Stephen asked me to take that on as, as, as uh, my pr number one task. Mm -hmm. And we did. We, we managed to double our vote amongst new Canadians from about 21% in the 2004 election to about 43% in the 2011 election, which undoubtedly was the key element in us winning the majority government in suburban areas around Toronto yeah. and Vancouver, for example.